今年近五十岁的丹尼尔最近比较忙，除了自己的工作之外，多个周末他还会与自己的妻子一起到街头巷尾，把示威者曾粘贴或涂抹在墙上的痕迹清理掉。拥有一张外国面孔的丹尼尔在人群当中格外显眼。Generally speaking, we're both very angry and very upset. As to what's happening in Hong Kong, cleaning up is just a very simple and a very effective way of showing support、uh, for the special administrative region of Hong Kong as part of mainland China, and also showing、uh, support for mainland China. It's a very simple way of showing that there, there can be another way forward, as opposed to violence and、uh, mob and terrorist-like activity. 二零一九年六月，香港爆发修例风波，部分激进示威者借反修例之名，在香港各区肆意破坏、打砸纵火。这些行为让来港多年的丹尼尔愤怒且无奈。And when I've gone out and I've seen some of the damage myself, it's it's very very bad. I think it's very dangerous. I think of Hong Kong like my home. If you can imagine someone coming into your own home, and Breaking your TV, or destroying your kitchen, or throwing all of the utensils on the floor, it would make you feel very upset because you would feel that your home has been destroyed. It's been disrupted, which I think is fundamentally、uh, wrong. Daniel 来自澳大利亚，一九九五年第一次来港旅行，因被香港的活力和多样化所吸引，遂于一九九八年决定定居香港。二十几年来，他在香港落地扎根，组建了公司和家庭，还拥有了自己的中文名字宋启峰。他理解市民有诉求，但其实质是香港社会的深层次问题，不应片面地将其原因归咎于政府。Hong Kong has always represented, which is primarily a very safe and a very free and a very fantastic place to work and live. In living here for 21 years. Ever a feeling like I am personally not free, so I fundamentally don't believe there is a fight for freedom. I do agree that there is a sense of social discontent, but to point the finger and to blame all of that discontent and all of that social grievance towards the government, the mainland government, is to me foolish. I think it's the equivalent of looking for a scapegoat. 丹尼尔认为，香港问题的其中一个根源在教育，每一位学生都应了解本国的历史。他称，香港的出路是创建对话，让香港人参与到祖国的建设发展中。By some evidence, it suggests that kids from a very young age have actually not been educated to actually love their mother country, so they've been brought up already to have negative feelings towards mainland China. Uh, I went to school in Melbourne. There was、uh, explicitly a topic called Australian history. History is not propaganda. Understanding your history should be a part of the education system. You need to create a dialogue locally. You need to create a dialogue、uh, regionally in terms of together with mainland China, and you need to determine together a future. Forward and a way forward. Daniel and his wife love traveling. For many years, he has traveled the world and visited a large number of Chinese cities. He is very optimistic about the future of China and has faith in Hong Kong's future. He believes that this tsunami will become a small piece of the history of the world. As the world moves forward, he considers the future of the world. We are very supportive and very encouraged by the future. We are both very supportive and very encouraged by the future. That that is available to all of us、uh, with the mainland Chinese future, and we're both in agreement that there's still there's still a wonderful opportunity for Hong Kong. A majority of Hong Kong Chinese want、um, a prosperous China. They want a prosperous Hong Kong. They want peace. They they want goodwill for everybody. So I would like to think that what we're seeing is only a very 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 small part of history, and it will be cleaned up. 丹尼尔和妻子参与的青年快闪社区清洁大行动已成功举办了二十三次，在众多参与者的努力下，香港部分曾被粘贴海报、胡乱涂鸦的墙壁已恢复如初。
。如今，越来越多人加入城市清洁的队伍，香港这颗东方蜘蛛上的尘埃正慢慢褪去。更多精彩尽在中国新闻网客户端。